हेलो स्टूडेंट वेलकम टू माय चैनल टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न एन इम्पोर्टेंट टॉपिक्स वार्म एंड वार्म व्हील इट इज ए सिंपल लिफ्टिंग मशीन under engineering mechanics in worm and worm wheel there is two main parts or components number 1 square threaded screw square threaded screw it is called worm and number 2 a toothed wheel called worm wheel a wheel there is teeth number of teeth on the wheel periphery it is just like gear both worm and worm wheel are gear together axis of the worm and this axis of the worm wheel are perpendicular to each other actually if this is worm worm wheel is in this position perpendicular okay in this position okay now a wheel a a wheel is attached to the worm effort p is applied to the one end of the rope which is passes over the wheel okay this is load dump load dump is cylindrical shape a load dump cylindrical shape is securely mounted on the worm wheel and the load w is connected to the string this is string or rope runs around the load dump runs around the load dump okay let one complete revolution to be given to the effort wheel this is effort we wheel because effort is applied at that wheel the distance for one revolution the distance moved by effort pi d okay distance moved by effort pi d if worm is single threaded if worm is single threaded means single start then for one revolution of the 
effort will warm also one revolution the warm would push the warm wheel one teeth because warm wheel is single start or single thread okay warm pushes the warm wheel through one teeth okay it is rotated in this direction if the number of teeth number of teeth on the warm wheel t number of teeth t then one push of one teeth a push of one teeth the load dam this load dam will move one by t revolution okay again this square threaded screw and effort wheel are supported to end and rotated freely on two bearings we applied effort on this rope then for one rotation of the effort wheel the worm also rotated one revolution worm push the one teeth of the worm wheel because worm is single start worm wheel and load dam securely attach so dam rotate one by t revolution okay let effort wheel a diameter capital d okay worm wheel number of teeth capital t load dam diameter small d load lifted w load lifted upward okay now one revolution of the wheel a one revolution of the wheel a the distance moved by effort y distance moved by effort y equal to pi d if the worm is single threaded then for one revolution of the effort wheel for one revolution of the effort wheel worm will complete one revolution worm also complete one revolution okay so the worm will push the worm wheel through one teeth so a worm single threaded so for one rotation it is push one teeth the worm will push the worm wheel through one teeth the load dam will move one by t revolution the load dam will move one by t revolution because worm wheel number of teeth t the load dam will move one by t revolution okay so the distance moved by load dam x equal to pi d into 1 by t 
for one rotation this is the diameter of the load dump small d one rotation distance moved by load dump pi d for one by t revolution the distance moved by load dump x equal to pi d pi small d into one by t okay now velocity ratio vr distance moved by effort y distance moved by load distance moved by load distance moved by load load is lifted upward distance moved by load equal to distance moved by load equal to pi d into 1 by t distance moved by effort equal to pi capital d distance moved by load x equal to pi small d into 1 by t equal to capital d by small d into t capital d diameter of the effort wheel a small d diameter of the load dump t equal to number of teeth of the worm wheel okay it is clear my student working principle of worm and worm wheel and velocity of the worm and worm wheel okay thank you